Today in this short video I am going to discuss Richard the Soy Sauce poem Animal Crackers and give a short analysis on it. Before entering the poem it is better for us to know something about the background issues of his uh, family. Uh, you know that uh, Soy Sauce Animal Crackers is uh, a prescribed poem for Sri Lankan advanced level English literature. Richard the Soy Sauce was born in Colombo and he belonged to upper middle social class. His mother uh, is Dr. Manohari Saranamuttu and father Lucien de Soisa. Uh, he was educated in St. Thomas uh, College in Mount Lavania and later he became English teacher, journalist as well as an, good, as well as an actor. He acted in films like Ugante and some teledramas also. Anyway, Soisa appeared for the suffering social class. You know, in 88-89 season, there was a violent made by Stade. And, uh, and during that time, Soisa appeared for the suffering class. Anyway, on the 18th of February 1999, Soisa was abducted from his home and his dead, dead body was found two days later on Moratua Korolavella Beach with uh, gunshot injuries in his head. Anyway, uh, he was murdered by Ranasinga Premadasa's regime as a result of going against the prevailing uh, unfair situation. And uh, later, uh, uh, an award, uh, award has been found by the United Nations in Soisa's name in recognition of independent journalism. Now I uh, go to this poem, Animal Crackers. Animal crackers. Uh, first, the poem goes like a dialogue between father and son. Child say, draw me a lion, so I set my fan to work, produce a lazy, kindly, beast, color it yellow. Now, you know, the child asked father to draw me a lion, so I set my fan to work, produce a lazy, kindly beast. Lion is a lazy, kindly beast. Lion symbolizes singular nation. It is the symbol of national flag. So is a right ridicules that because that time there were no lions because singular people were against Tamil people in that time. So it's a speaks of 83 uh, Black July violence made by then Jarjavardhana's reading. This it bites for a child as he says sometimes but only when it's angry. If you fool its tail or say that it's just a cat, another cat fool, but for the moment of fast indolent be double basking in the sun of ancient pride. Ancient pride, dear Soisa, speaks of the uh, ancient pride in the history that we speak about our kings and ancient things. In the bracket there is outside, the sunlight seems a trifle dull, then there's a distant roaring, like a tribe of lions cross had been awakened from long deep sleep. Singular people are equated to lions and they are sleeping, they are lazy. Then draw me a tiger, vision of a beast uh, compounded of Jim Corbett Yams. Jim Corbett Yams is an artist uh, and Blake. Blake is a poet. You know William Blake wrote a poem called uh, Tigers. Then uh, draw me a tiger, the child says, then stalks through my mind, blazing nature's warning, black bars on gold, that Jim Corbett Yams also killed many tigers in Indian jungles. Draw, you know, uh, tiger also symbol for uh, LTT, Liberation Tigers of Tamil Elam. At the derivative point of creating LTT, Sinhala people had been uh, responsible, especially the prevailing ruling system that paved the way for people to take arms against the innocent Tamilians, Tamils in 1983, Black July. Many uh, Tamil innocent, innocent civilians, Tamil civilians were assassinated by the roads with roadblocks where the government head pronounced that uh, the people can't be protected by the government and their custody should be provided by themselves. Draw, you turn, draw me the gun on me as I show that three years old understand force magic. That means the writer again speaks of the government forced uh, violence and you pull the silly plastic trigger as hell breaks loose quite suddenly the sky is full of smoke and orange stripes of flame 
the poet recalls how uh, Tamil bodies were burnt by the road in Black July. But there, here there are no tigers, here there are only lions. No tigers, lions, because all Tamil people were not members of LTT movement. LTT movement members were there, but in innocent Tamil civilians like shoemakers, scavengers in Colombo, and especially traders were there. Their property was looted by Sinhala people, and you know, something tragic happened in the history. And the jackals and panting rabbit in the roaring wake, infecting all the madness as they passed while my lord, the elephant says his head shaded arbor. My lord, elephant mean, elephant mean they are Jayavardhan because United National Party symbol is elephant. That time they are Jayavardhan threw oil on the flames, but he didn't try to set off these uh, flames of the racial fire. Put down that gun, if you do, you are good. I'll draw a picture of that elephant, the curious beast that you understand. Again, the father, narrator, says to his child that uh, elephant is a curious beast that you must understand. You know that? Ranasinghe Premadas as well as J.R. Javadan both had a wrath against uh, Soisa, so that later Soisa began writing his uh, name with the pen name Angela the Silva, but he was found later. What is marvelous is that uh, himself belonging to capitalized uh, Colombo society, but he appeared for the general public, suffering ones like garment girl, prostitutes, uh, beggars like that. Yeah. Yes, uh, don't look out the window, just a party down the lane, bonfire and some fireworks and they are burning, no, not a tiger, just some silly cat. That is about uh, that uh, Black July burning the properties and Yes, mob of Sinhala ne, attacking people, to, ne, killing them. Colombo, 25 July 1983. He witnesses this uh, two days later. For Dimitri, Dimitri means his son, when he's old enough to understand, he writes this poem saying, I am writing this for my child Dimitri, for old enough to understand. Richard the Soisa is one celebrated Sri Lankan poet who uh, raised his voice against the prevailing system. And we must appreciate his dedication because he had to crucify his life also because of that okay uh, the brutal ruling system that time led by Ranasing and Premadasa abducted this man this innocent person worth person celebrated English teacher and he was murdered right uh, in next poem I will give another analysis goodbye